Welcome everyone. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to install a mod, patch, or a game cheat within Yuzu for Android. See, late last year, the development team updated their app to include a very useful per game setting feature. The update allows you to change specific Yuzu settings when running a specific app. And this is done by long pressing on a game and then going through this menu and selecting a specific setting such as playing the game in docked mode or handheld mode, changing graphic options, and adjusting the audio which again is all tied to this specific game. The new update also change the way that you install a mod, a patch, or a cheat to a game that you already have loaded in your games folder. So while you can still install these via the original method, which I have a video showing here on this channel, there's actually a new way that this can be done and it's so much easier than before. To begin, we need to open up the Yuzu application and then view the main games page. Now, just like before, we're going to long press on a game that you want to install a mod or a cheat for. And then we're going to select the add-ons option here. You may already be familiar with this page as this is where you go to install game updates and DLC packages. But this is also where you go to install a mod, a patch, or a cheat to a game as well. We just need to select the mods and cheats option in this pop-up, tap on OK, and then you're gonna be sent to a file browser. As of right now, you will need to extract the mod or cheat that you have downloaded. That will result in an entire folder being stored and saved in your internal storage. And then you're going to want to find that folder through this file browser. I have read that the development team is working on letting you install these by simply selecting the zip file instead but we will need to wait for that update before it is allowed. For now, you're only able to select entire directories. So again, you need to extract the mod or cheat that you have downloaded and then choose that folder that you have decompressed. That cheat will show up in this list here just like your updates and DLC packages are, and you can enable or disable them through the toggles there. But that's all there is to it. There's no need to find the game folder code and manually transfer that folder anymore, as this can all be done with the per game settings page itself, and it is a much welcomed addition to the app.